Commonwealth's world champion. We'll find out soon. Apo George Jack. Representing Romania up against Poland's Adrian Dushak. Should be quite a match, really. Two fairly even. They've met before. They've both got a lot of experience. VIPs enjoyed the little session of entertainment provided by Team Ronaldo Junior and Team Thailand. And tomorrow there'll be plenty of action as well. Here's how these two got to the final. Good victory in the semis, easily enough. In fact, hasn't been taken past five points in any of his matches, Apo Georgiak. And on the other side will be his Polish opponent, and Dushak also coming through unscathed without dropping a set in his route to the final. Notable victories there against Raboeli and Marovic in the quarters. So there's the head-to-head 3-2. -head Apo Georgiak looking to retain his title here. Last year in Nuremberg, he was absolutely magnificent in thrashing Dushak, really. 12-8, 12-6. Has been revenge for the Polish player, but he starts second favorite in the final today, but it's a final, it's a one-off, and anything can happen. Here we go then for the final time today. Tamás Osvéd of Hungary is our referee. The assistant referee that you don't see behind the camera is Peter Bobé, both uh, Hungarians. Wearing his familiar yellow, the defending world champion, Apo Georgia. Top seed, world number one in men's singles, has been for a while. Claimed his first world crown last year in Germany at the World Championships in Nuremberg. Up against him is Adrian Dushak of Poland. Comes from the capital Warsaw, plays for the Technical Club, the Academy Club. Sweet side. Also, as I said, not dropping a set so far this week. So both these two are in good form. As I said, they met in this final last year. But for Dushak, will it be heartache in a World Championship final for a third time because he was also runner-up in 2019 in the third edition of the World Championships. On that occasion... He was uh, beaten by Blasiewicz. George Jack, imperious at this level. And as you see this week, no one's put a glove really on it. Eight sets to nil for both of them. But it's been more impressive from George Jack. Dushak, dusting off the cobwebs, back in action. And looking forward to hopefully for him, third time lucky in a World Championship final. Been a great day of action. Started round about midday with the women's semi-finals. Brought you live the bronze matches and the women's singles. Now it's the turn of the men. So Georgiak, 23 years of age, five years younger than his opponent and Pass plays the ball, for the Gorbeck Tech to team. Has dropped just 29 points in eight sets this week. Team Romania to serve. Averaging just four points, dropping First again. A set rather. So Georgia will serve first. Oh. See the figure on the uh, advertising hoardings around the edge. Second of the Arena here. Prize money, biggest ever. Another record, quarter of a million dollars. Oh, Dushak. point to Romania. Well positioned there, but the cry of relief and joy from George Jack as he takes the point. It's disappointing for the top first male players that they're not getting three points on the first of the rounds of four serves. Dushak quickly it does well, really well. Very agile player, George Jack. Hasn't got the sort of serve of uh, Chava Banyak with real pace. 
and real power. And it does give the opponent a chance to take points off him, but he's a masterful defender, as we saw Rafael Fontes do. He can do the same, and even more power when it's coming towards him. That's a good serve, low. Again, just takes the first touch away from the opponent, then forces to shut back, Point and he can't Romania. get there. Technically, very good point. Tech as everyone will be really applauding that. Not quite as spectacular as some, but the technique involved. Beautiful. Look at the way he realigned his foot to get a little bit more power, a little bit more bounce. First service. Net. Talk about how few points Georgiak has uh, dropped. 29 Second points in eight sets. Well, Dushak also hasn't lost a set, but 54 points he has dropped in his four matches. Point to Romania. So he takes 3 1 on the first set of four. Apo Georgiak. Change series. Well, it's this sort of form that has led him to numerous awards. Reached the semi-final for the fourth successive World Cup. Was third in 2019, the Romanian. George Jack reached the semis again oh, in 2020. Lost there and lost the bronze medal match. 2021, we didn't have an event because of COVID. 2022, we were back. And, sorry, 2020 was cancelled. 2021, reached the semis. First and then 2022, finally got his hands on the world title after George Jack. Dushak trying to make sure he Point gets at least Poland. three, and what a good serve that is. Low, powerful, and with perfect direction, right into the postage stamp of the table. Difficult to do, even on a flat table, even more difficult on a curved table. Post service. Skim the surface beautifully. That one a little bit higher up the table, so there was more of a bounce, a little easier for his opponent to get there just avoided breaking the halfway line and conceding for an illegal attack. Out. Point to Poland. Dushak making sure that he's maintaining a lead here. First he serve. After the first set needs this to hold serve at 2-2 and maintain a two-point advantage. Point to Romania. So he gets a point back. So 4 4, the serves are shared. And uh, it's not all about the powerful. Sometimes the Change delicate service. can win the point. Try to get his bounce twice on the table. And even if it doesn't, it's dipping and falling off the edge of the table. Post service. So difficult to get your foot underneath. Such a fast moving sport as well. Good control from Dushak. Again, does well. Point Make sure Poland. he doesn't go and break the halfway line. Dynamite finish. Look at him trying to calm himself down. Heavy breathing, deep breathing. What an angle he created there. George Jack thought he was in position. Dushak bypassed. First service. Out. Point to Romania. A poor miss from there, and he will know it. Dushak so often with the runner up. First service. Twice in the World Championships. Also claimed silver at the singles in Next. Krakow at the European Games in the summer. Also reached the semi finals of the men's doubles with his regular partner, Marek Pokwap. Partnered Pokwap again in the second service. last event in Pula in Croatia. And he reached the quarter finals then. Edge ball. Oh. Replay the point with it being an edge ball. Indeed, throughout his career, Dushak has only ever won one title. And that was a challenger title. And it came in Brazil back in 2020. And the man he beat in the final, the man wearing yellow on your screen now, George Jack, long since got revenge. And looking for another scalp over the Polish player. Great oh, head. Oh, oh, power on that. Like the rifle from the bullet, the sniper header. Absolutely nailed 
by Apo Georgiak. Super overhead shot as well. Well, he's just been demolishing opponents this week. Some notable scalps as well, not just Rabo in the semi final where he was pushed further than at any previous time, Dushak, but Marojevic, one of the world's best doubles players, see him in action tomorrow. He's beaten in the quarterfinals and coasted through the round of 16 and 32. Both these two were seeded, oh. so didn't Point have to take part in the group stage. But Georgiak has just been so impressive. Had a tricky round of 16 match against the Thai player we just saw in the Change of service. exhibition match, Utun Kukairo. I can see just eight points. Just take another look at that in motion from Georgiak. First service. Already seen tears once tonight. Oh, point what to a point. serve that is. Ushak hanging on to the coattails oh. of the world champion with more serving like this. Anything is possible. First service. Great start to the batch of four serves. Can he get back level now? Oh, it's point another killer serve. They are so difficult. They come at you so low and so powerfully. Look at the technique here. Look at where it hits on the table. It was right down the line as well. That's absolutely perfect. Can he do it three out of three? You bet he can. Another point. Point to Poland. Turns around the 7-5 deficit to the defending champion and goes in front for the first time. Well, it really is a defensive sport in Poland. Tech ball, and this will be warmly greeted and get quite a lot oh. of newcomers as well. If Dushak can cause a sensation here and finally get his hands on a major trophy, and not just any old big trophy, but the biggest second in the sport, the World Championships. Here we are in Thailand, in Bangkok. 8-7, second serve for Adrian Dusha. Out, double fault, point to Romania. Three excellent serves, and then the captain's fault. Change of Doesn't service. quite ruin it all, but he's got back from a precarious position. First service. Two points adrift. Well, with the advantage of the serve, in theory, could win it with a clean sweep of four on serve here, and he's well placed to get the first one. Good defending needed from Dushak. Still a lot of work to do, but he did it really well. Coming back at you though, sniper header, good control, stays in it. Now it goes with him. Oh, well, Point to Romania. From a bit of distance, it was difficult. But again, one of those mistakes that Must he will win. Win a world title, those have probably got to be going over. First service. George Jack then, serving. Three serves to come, three points away. Great serve, it's a Point good. to Romania. Exactly what we saw from Dushak at a previous set of four. Let's have a look at how this compared. Powerful, low, well directed, just kisses the table. It's unplayable. Not quite a clean ace. Might as well have been service winner. Well, under pressure, like a true champion, Apo Georgiak has responded very well with two high first quality service. serves. Two more will give him the first set in the men's final. Out. First to two sets. Second service. Four successive world championship Net. semi final. Double point. Well, point to Poland. The symmetry continues here. Remember, Dushak came up with three brilliant serves and then served a double. So first serves six. kicking in here. You can see one double each now after we went through the first 15 points without a double. Dushak, work to do there. It'll come back at him with. Extra interest. Edge ball. Oh, edge ball. Dushak will settle for that. Georgiak should have won it and should have moved to set points. Well, had the whole table to aim at. Found the edge. A let off for Adrian. First Dushak. service. Last of his serves, remember. Out. And two very, very good serves and service winners, and then suddenly two poor serves. Second service. Dushak hanging on in there. And the 28 roll from Warsaw or Warsaw. Putting the 
Oh, 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 back under oh, pressure. And Georgia thankfully avoided hitting the table. It was a little bit further away than it might have looked from the camera. But just saw the ball just sneaking away from him a little bit and had to launch a dive there. But it was all in vain. So we're at 10-10. Change of service. Remember, first or second set, you do not have to win by two points. So we're almost at sudden death here. With the serve. First service. Dushak will be bitterly disappointed if he can't wrap it up. Just now needs two of those good serves. The unplayable ones that he got in the previous set of four. Good serve, but not quite perfect. Oh, but the mistake from that poor Georgiak is celebrated. But he's still got one point to win the set. But he has two opportunities now. 11 10. Set points now. Set point to Poland. Even if he loses it, still got the sudden death point to win the set. First service. Underdog, Adrian Dushak. Serving. One good serve away from the opening set. It is a good serve. George Jack oh, still in it, but he makes a mistake. In and of the third set. And Adrian Dushak strikes first in the men's final. Well, for long periods, that set he was behind, right from 3 1 at the start. And then found himself 7 5 and 10 8 down. But four points in a row give Adrian Dushak the set. 12 10. Minor surprise here from the nearly man against the defending champion. We said he needed good serves. He got two good serves. Didn't win it there, but it was too much for George Jack to stay in the rally. Couldn't use his three touches to get it back on the table. Trying to try and just calm down. Let's have a look at the statistics of that first set, which went the way of the Polish player. To many people's surprise, look at that serving. 90% first serves in and 80% first serves point one. Dwarf Georgiak, his service is good, but he's more mobile and more defensive. Unforced error is six apiece. It's time to start the Georgiak second set. knows he's in a Poland game now. Serve. What a match this could do. First service. You can never ride off Apple George Jack. Didn't get to world number one without some brilliant comebacks. Point to Poland. Keep serving like that and you will not get beaten. That's the simple equation. First service. Well, last year, it was straight sets. The pole was beaten 12-8, 12-6 oh. by the Romanian. We know it won't be the same now. George Jack has to come from behind if he's to Second defend service. the world title. Point to Romania. Only once in the history of Tech Bowl World Championships has a player retained First the singles service. title. Carolyn Greco couldn't quite manage it in the women's event earlier, falling in the semis. Oh! I thought George Jack has gone one step nearer. And before, the only player to do it was Adam Blazovic, who won three of the Second first service. four editions in 2017 and 2019 and 2021, but he did win successive oh, titles because 2020 was cancelled. One of those wins for Blazovic in 2019 was against the Polish player, Dushak. First service. So often the runner-up. Can he get his first ever big trophy? Out. Never won a full tour trophy. Never won a European Games or a world title. He's had opportunities, but it's just fallen short. Georgiak under pressure. Just put too much on that. I think it's over halfway. Not called. Well, to me, it looked like he was over halfway. I'm slightly off centre in my commentary position up in the stand. No appeal. Let's have another look at this. Not sure if we'll have the right camera angle for it. In fact, we might run out of time. Get back to the live action, maybe have a look at that in a little while. First service. So George Jack, maybe a little lucky to be 3-1 up here, but coming Point under pressure. 
the serve enabled Dushak to get underneath it and then absolutely smash the winner. Great control, nowhere near the halfway line when he hit the ball. First service. to take a second point out of two off the Romanian serve. George Jack struggling here. Wow, it'll take something special from there. Oh, oh is it a side or an edge, edge ball? It's, uh, oh, gets away with it. From that position, you'll take an edge ball every day of the week. In fact, if you could aim and know you could hit the edge, it's the perfect opportunity because even had that landed properly on the table, would very likely have lost the point on the next attempt of the three points. Did he mean it on the edge or not? First sentence. Yeah, he's happy. Nailed it, he says. Of course I meant. Out. And Algenia among the spectators directly behind. Second the service. Referee down there. It's a good hit from Dushak. Maybe not quite middle. Gives George Jack the opportunity, Out. but another mistake from the defending Baller. champion. And it's looking like an off-colour apple, George Jack. Suddenly, he's just waltzed his way through, has not been taken past five points in any set this week. Round of 32, won four and one. Round of 16, won five and three. Quarterfinals, the Jonathan Coquel of Belgium. 12-2, 12-5, good to see the Belgians represented here well. Out. And in the semis, you might have seen earlier in the live feed, Brian Thompson of Denmark beaten five Second and four. But now, Georgiak is in real trouble. Dushak, a setter, and Point taking the, the lead of the second set with another super hit. Middle that one, clean strike from the 28-year-old from the First Technical Volso Academy. Edge ball. Oh, he thought he won it. He's going for it and immediately going for Challenge the TV Christi replay, the VAR. By Poland for edge ball. Tanas Ozvec called Edge Ball. Well, it looks very similar to the one we saw in the women's singles earlier. That does not look like an edge to me. And you got to say, the players usually know the, the referee is off centre. When it's on the far side, it's very difficult for them to see. That's going to be overturned, surely. He will therefore retain the one appeal. Pacing around, he can't sit still, Adrian Dushak. Apo Georgia looking completely unruffled, just standing on the spot. Well, I'm surprised it hasn't been overturned already. I'd like to make absolutely sure. That looks a little bit more like an edge, doesn't it? But still, for me, the ball has landed on the table. And I would say that the appeal would be successful. No edge ball, point to Poland. Let's see what... The guys in the truck are telling Tamas Ozvec. Decision incoming. Challenge is completed. No edge ball. Point to Poland. Well, they can celebrate a point twice as Adrian Dushak. Change of service. I could do that VAR job. Got that one right. <laughs> First service. Well, Gino returned to the shades indoors. And the hat has never left his head. Net. Yeah, just telling himself to calm down there. I don't know if you saw the palms down. Dushak needs to not get too excited. Second he service. Use the energy and the emotion. He's come back brilliantly here. Good run of points here for Dushak to turn it around. Edge ball. Oh, he's lucky there. New second serve. service. Still only got the one chance, has to make this count. Doesn't want a captain's fault, they nearly had before. Double he has double fault. Point to Romania. Oh, just when you get a run of points to then double fault is even more infuriating. Not the best of ways to start. Set of four. Sorry if I'm repeating myself for old school techers among you, but 
do get a lot of new viewers, especially for the World Championships, and worth reiterating. First service. It's first to 12, and serves in batches of four. Second serve Point of the four from Dushak is a lot better than the first, which saw the double fault. Big serve, so important, and boy has he got a big serve. Probably the, maybe the second best server on the tour of the men's game. First service. Chama Banyak with his enormous height, we'll see him in the doubles tomorrow, gets such power on his Point kicks. to Fuller. But being a little smaller means the ball just won't bounce up as much from Dushak. Time out to Romania. And you can give him the double fault when he can come back with two like that and has a three-point lead over the defending champion and a set already in the bag. Not surprising, the Romanian called timeout. Well, we've, we get so few aces in a match. Usually, service winners are as good as it gets. And there have been numerous serves unreturned from Adrian Dusha. Polish player today. I've never seen him play better in this sport. I've seen a lot of him. Agonizingly for him, Silver in Krakow. Twice runner up in the World Championship. Last year, losing to this man on the opposite side of the table. The timeout. 60 seconds has End of the timeout, come please. Back come the gladiators in the auditorium. We're in Bangkok, it's the Bangkok Arena. The end of the first day, look first at that Stringer point, six points out of seven. Having been 3-1 down. Last of the four serves for... Dushak, he's won two of the three previous points. Setting himself up nicely here. Little dig over, it's point there, the Paula. harvester. Just short enough over the net. Dushak tried to eat up the ground, but he couldn't get there. A delicate touch, the second bounce on the table, making absolutely sure. What a comeback from 3-1 down. First service. Do get, often in tech ball, runs of points. Georgia. Definitely capable of stringing together, especially on serve. Might seem a long way behind, just four points Five away six. from victory, Dushak. Four points adrift, Georgiak, when he started this set of four. Four big Ooh. serves, Point to and that's two out of two. Can draw him back level. That's the carrot, the incentive. Look at the trajectory again. Doesn't get high, it's on the downward curve of the tail that Five helps six. it skim off the surface like a pebble on the lake out couldn't quite catch the end of the table or the edge even there so it's a second serve second service now he can't really go for that blockbuster a little pace off but it's still decent enough but enough for Dushak to get underneath it and put some aggression in here comes the big edge shot ball. oh well I don't know whether he's lucky or unlucky there Dushak I think is relieved from the position that it was in at that point so it stays 8-6, and they repeat the rally. There you go, you can see the side of the First rally. service! Should have nailed a winner there, really. I think Dushak showed his relief. Now he has a chance to set himself up. Didn't side quite ball. do with Point the to second touch what he should have done. Needed a bit more elevation to allow him the big smash. So relief for Georgiak, who makes it three points out of three on Sir. The momentum switching again. Get back level here. First service! And then Dushak will be under pressure on his serve. 7-8, Apo Georgiak, defending world champion, fighting for Point his life Romania. and fighting brilliantly. Another service winner, is he? He's appealing, I think. Going to be Challenge Aaron, is requested yeah. by Poland for edge ball. Well, yeah, he must have thought it would be in the edge. Didn't look like it to me. So 8-7, if this is not the edge, it's 8 all. Doesn't look it on that view, and let's have another angle, I think. Absolutely no evidence that that's near the edge when it bounced. Don't think we'll need 12 replays of this one. Incoming already, I suspect. Little pause for thought then, I think. 
it is shown on the screen here and uh, both players know the outcome is almost inevitable and so it will tick over to 8-8 surely surely the appeal will be challenge rejected challenge completed no edge ball point to Romania no more challenge for team Poland so they heard as well importantly no more challenge Dushak has wasted Poland his challenge look to risky one to take and if it goes into a third set especially he may regret that one challenge per tie not per set Ooh, Point to Poland. wins it that was close to the edge great response kept his cool we talked about the pressure if Georgiak got it back to eight all and he did what a response from Adrian Dushak just imagine what is going through his mind and his right now too ready but Dushak so often failing at the final hurdle. First service. Lost again this year in June in the European Games on home territory. Described it as a memorable experience, of course. Oh, from there. Oh, oh so close. Point but it's a two point gap with two serves to come. Two serves for glory. Two serves to become world champion. Clean sweep from George Jack on serve. Pegs the pole First back series. at eight all. Now composes himself. George Jack with the big first hit in the run. Oh, what Point a winner! What a winner! It's three championship points for Adrian Dushak. Oh, he's taking a timeout. Maybe he wants Time to save at the moment. Team what an extraordinary hit that was. The technique was unbelievable. Wow, look at the reaction. Well, he wanted to do it. I don't think even he expected to do it. Nerves, what nerves. Quite astute thinking as well, just to ensure he didn't get carried away in the moment. Compose himself for the next serve. Take a little bit more time. You have a timeout. If you blow this position, then you would fear for him in the final set. George Yaku has looked almost unbeatable at times in singles. Rushed aside the challenge of Dushak last season. Lost just 14 points in the final. Well, he's already won 23. 24, the golden number. Can he do it? 15 seconds remaining of the timeout. But it seems like about 10 minutes for him. He'll just want to get back out there, but just has to compose himself. George Jack almost looking like it's just a practice game. He End of wait the time no longer. He was already off his chair before time ran out. Match point to Poland. So four opportunities for Adrian Dushak. He doesn't want to let it get down to the third or heaven forbid the fourth can he do it here and now no. on serve no the first serve evades him and that is a huge relief for George Jack because remember if he takes Second this service. point 9-11 first to 12 no two point margin and George Jack's serve to come so pressure on no. this one double he's double faulted wow maybe taking the timeout was not so astute will he rue that double fault a captain's fault when it was match point and can Apple George Jack cruelly deny the pole again high drama Ready? here change of service in Romania Thailand serve. first service a hush descends in the Bangkok arena in this gripping final it's only a second set edge ball if Apple takes this and sends us into a third goodness knows New first service. I will feel. George Jack will feel reprieved. Net. Oh, what a mistake that is. Needs that first serve because it's still match points, remember. Like a prisoner being Second led service. to the gallows at 11 8. Can he get Net. another step of education? Point two, he four. cannot. The execution's complete. It's title at last for Adrian Dusha. He has waited so long, he has suffered so many heartaches, but he has beaten the unbeatable. He's vanquished his opponent and the nightmares.
And at last, we say, Adrian Dushak, you are a champion. Not only old champion, you're the champion of the world. 12-10, 12-9, it's glory for Dushak, it's glory for Poland. What a win against the odds. Thailand and the Tech Ball world salutes a champion and commiserates with a defeated champion. There is no successful defence for Apo Georgiak. He's the world number one, but the world champion, it's a different matter. Tears flow again on the court at the arena in Bangkok. Delight for Poland. Excellent sportsmanship. It's an important foundation of this sport. They really do get on so well together. You scarcely hear or see a crossword and different players and nations come together at tables in the dining areas. But the heartache of defeat in the final, not once, but twice, is being erased here thanks to a quite breathtaking performance, especially on serve. But in the end, it was the mistake on serve from his opponent that made that special moment for Adrian Dushak of Poland. Well, every reaction has an equal and opposite reaction, as someone once said. The joy and the pain, the glory and the heartache two sides of the same coin. For every winner, there has to be a loser. And he's lost so many times before in the big matches. We keep reminding you, defeat to Adam Blazovic and to 